Hey all, welcome to Let's Play Notori Box. This is a uh, puzzle platformer game developed by the Dozen Circle, uh, calling themselves Bird Strike. So yeah, this is one of the several hundred, i.e. 11, games I got from the last Retaisai. The Retaisai of the number 9, so yeah. And of course, for some reason, I'm deciding to record this, because heck, why not? So anyways, here we have the title screen. Here we can see Natori, and C is holding a box. Well, with a mechanical arm. But C is holding a box nonetheless. The inspiration for the title is so amazing. So anyways, clearly we should press continue, because we totally have a save file here. Anyways, here are our options. Sound options. Control options. As your options. That's about all you need. But... Without further ado, let us actually play the game. And then we go through the story I can't read because, well... I, I never bother to ever try to learn something. Actually, I did try at one point, but, well... Um, that didn't go well. That didn't go through at all, so yeah. Anyways, here we have someone sleeping. I presume it's Notori, because, I don't know. I can maybe try to figure out their names in, like, Japanese or something, but, uh, oh, then Marissa stole the thing. Or maybe even several things. And very possibly they could be Pressus. But anyways. So yeah, Marissa just kind of took off, and I guess we're gonna have to go say that to her or something. So let us start on stage one. Here we are, and oh my gosh, there's a thing. Ha! Ah! Well, that was fun. And we'll just kind of throw it against that wall. Oh, no, God, it's respawning. So, anyways, here is a sign. It's probably teaching us how to play. I kind of already played the trial, so I maybe kind of know what I'm doing, maybe. So, anyways, you can throw things. Fun thing, you can actually grab these while they're um, spawning. In one of the trials, they didn't actually have the spawn effect. You can, you could actually just kind of grab them out of nowhere. And it was kind of a thing. Did I read you? But anyways, um, if you're holding an enemy like this, when you, um... Well, let's see, yeah, if you do that, you can double some. And you kind of heard a sound effect there, once you will kind of learn more of it. No, I want those! Stupid thing. But anyways, um... Here, this is probably explaining this next thing. The Tori can float for some unknown defined reason. Yes, our scientists will have to figure this out at some point. But yes, that's about the extent of her abilities, I think. Yeah, that's pretty... that's it, and then the rest of everything is like a thing. So anyways, um... here, reading this is... well, I don't know what it said. But, here, here's a key! And do we need, like... was it that we need three of those? I don't know. I'm gonna grab this, gonna leave. Oh, hey, look at those key symbols. Um... not sure if it's actually said. Or when it said, um, you can actually move the camera around. It's kind of neat. You can move the camera. I kind of like the gears in the corners, showing like the moving of the everything. Oh man, we're spoiling the entire rest of the level. So anyways, there's a door and there's a key. Uh, and there's another key over here. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, that's about the extent of it. Also, we have a menu. The amazing abilities Notori has. Yes. And I'm gonna grab this heart. We haven't taken any damage yet. It's kind of a thing. As you can see, we have three hearts. Count them three. Uh, grab you. Could totally double some across these, but you're not supposed to. So, anyways, we got 30 out of 30 um, screws. We don't know why she's collecting screws, but well. Maybe she's making a really complex thing and needs them for some reason. Anyways, since we have three keys, we can go through this door. Yay! Level win. Now, fun thing about this game, um... That was a speedrun mode. Basically, the speedrun through the level. Um, speedrun mode actually uh, removes all the uh, screws in the level, so you can just focus on getting the level done as fast as possible. So yeah, that might be a thing I could do at some point. But for now, let's actually, you know, play the game and, you know, just kind of meander about and not, you know, rust through everything in the world. No, I can't get through. Freaking thing. 
Anyways, gonna kinda jump up here, cause... That's a thing down there. Hey, sweats. Well, that was exciting. We hit the switch and made it empty. Here's this! It's a thing! You can grab it. Well, that was exciting. So we're gonna- Hey, look, a box! It's like the title screen or something. Anyways, here's a box, and... On. It's one of them pressure-sensitive switches or something. Anyway, I'm gonna grab you. Because I kind of want to double jump for some reason. My minds are getting fancy now. Give. Give me you. Actually, there's a sign here. Let me read this. How to solve this puzzle? Can't read. We'll solve it myself. Alright. It's kind of that you can grab the, um... Enemies as they're spawning, just for the sake of speed. <laughs> hey, and there's a speed run mode even. Also, kind of a thing you can miss, I think. All oh, right, no, never mind. I got them. So there's actually one uh, screw hidden under your uh, little health bar there, but apparently, apparently, I'm lying. So uh, yes, you may now disregard me for like five seconds. As is, I don't know. So listen to the puzzle, whatnot. Heck, maybe it is even telling us the ways of the world. Actually, that's probably exactly what it's doing. Hey, you, give me you. Nyeh. There we go. I forget if the blocks coming up can actually hurt you or not, so maybe let's just not kind of mess with that. Do do do. So listen to world hunger probably written on that or something. Hey, give me the box. Hmm. It seems to be more of a thing. Yes, because we need that key. Hey, can you weigh that down? Yes, you can. We don't want you to fall off. Okay, so it can't hurt you. Wait, no, I want to read that sign. For the sake of reading all of the signs and making someone translate it at some later date. <laughs> yes, translate all of the signs. For no reason whatsoever. Anyway, it's day three. Hmm. Hey, we have a key marker thing on the bottom. That is kind of a thing. I'm gonna go grab this box. And Tori requires this box. Can I cross you? Yay! That was exciting. Um, it's gonna kind of throw it that way. I love how everything gets thrown straight. No, wait, actually, no, curious. Do you? You bounce off Ezzas, right? Oh, so I didn't even need that box. Jeez. Well. In the last level, that was. So, hey, grab this, and I'm gonna... No, I want my box! <laughs> I can't take the box with, this is saddening. So anyways, um... Hmm... There's the exit door, but we have, like, no keys. Well, this is an issue, isn't it? Let's see, what's up here? There's a key, and there's actually a way from the left. Well... I could totally obsess over seeing if there's anything actually to the left in the previous room, but that's actually just not. I may slightly know this level. By the way, this is like the last level that I was that was in, that's in the trial, so uh, yeah. <laughs> Past this, I'm completely um, unknowledgeable. So hey, how long has it been? About eight minutes. Yeah, doing pretty good. I should probably stop grabbing those hearts on the off chance I actually get hit. Just you know. It's this thing I could probably consider. Grab you. Give! Yay, not a screw. Do, do, do. Go over here, grab. Okay, right, you have to put an effort into grabbing that. Oh, I'm messing over here. That's exactly what I was second to. No, I want that! Oh man, I could totally. Actually, I'm gonna see if I can do that. Hold on here. T. <laughs> well, this is fun. M maybe they have like an advanced level that requires this for something. All right, I'm done. No. <laughs> After all that, I still missed the platform or the um saying. No, gra no, float, float. I mean, float. So, anyways. Da -da -da. Hey, you, give me you. And there we go. Now we're across. Or was this the last level? 
I think there might be one more level. I think I'm remembering one more. Unless I'm... I forget how long this level is, that's the thing. If it's... If it's... I, I, you know what, I don't even know anymore. So hey, a box! Notori Xbox. <laughs> Notori Xbox. Anyways. No, give! I mean, don't... Stomp. There we go. Yay, climbing ladders. Anyway, here up the sweats. It's a time sweats. I'm gonna grab that. Oh, hey! Here is a doll, and she is holding a bomb. And if we grab the bomb, she kinda dies. This rock looks like it can be blown up. You should blow it up. Then it blew up. I'm. And the explosion probably can hurt you. Listen, Siri. I'm gonna grab all of these. So, um, going around here. Hey, you. Hey, there was a red key. And it went and filled that slot down there at the bottom, mostly center. Okay, so I only need one more screw, and that's about it. Hey, look, one more screw. So great, okay. Now I go this way, and we find that we have looped around. Somehow. Yeah, it doesn't actually make any mechanical sense unless unless that was a really long hallway that went around the earth. Man, the Tori like walks it's a long distance. So anyways, now I can leave. Yay! Okay, so maybe I am more knowledgeable for more levels than I thought. Gonna grab you immediately. Hmm, here's a switz. Does the thing. Let's see, what do we require? So we require to get up there, I think. Point. And then it blew up. Alright, hold on here a second. Think if we can. Actually, I think I need to um, grab that screw. Can I grab that screw from here? No. Hold on here a second. Hey you. Hey you, walking gunpowder, go over that way. <laughs> Yoink. No jump. There we go. No. I don't want to blow up. Hit that, and go up here. Yay! Except I need the Katama. Oh, whatever. <coughs> I need to drop down for that anyways. Are you right there? Alright, so... No, that. Except I actually don't need to hit that quite immediately. Fun thing, if you jump and throw the bomb into the, um the switz, it'll blow up on you. That was a fun experience. <laughs> yep, that was so fun. Um, oh, there's a heart, in case you did blow yourself up. Oh, there's two hearts, too. Okay. The game's a little bit forgiving. Um, Notori can't jump that high. Yeah, how about that? Um... So, time sweat. You know, I'm gonna, do, I'm gonna do this. Can I float? Yeah, I can float. Then throw that there. Alright, cool. That is a thing that I did. Okay, what's up here? Oh, I guess it's in case you want to get back. Yeah, it's, I guess that works too. Hey, you. Oh, you're a bomb. Get away. Hmm. Can I go? So I'm guessing I'm gonna need to grab you and that and that and then you break. No, but you vanish suddenly. 
Alright, over here, we find a new object. It is a different type of box, and it does a thing. Um... Note to self, maybe actually throw it through the door before you do that. Anyways, there is a switch over there we need to hit. Well... We might want to hit that at some point then, I guess. See, this puzzle took me a while to figure out, because I didn't know what the balls that did. Like, when I was playing the trial, so yeah. So, what you're supposed to do here is throw that against the wall and... Hey, saying hi. Ah! Platform! Why do you do this? Why betray me, man? And you see this, you see your... God damn it. Give me about half a second here. I'm gonna stand here. I'm gonna grab this. I don't And you know, you know your fateful companion cube? Well, it gets to blow up today. And essentially what it does is suit and explodes into the right. It's kind of a thing. I don't know, I'm gonna have another bomb. And we'll head off into the continuation of this. Why are you here? No, really, why is there a cat in my hair? I don't know. Oh, it's if you, um... If you're on the other side, you can just kind of jump up. So you don't actually have to do the bomb thing. Oh, that's amazing. Got another key. What are you? Hey, a bomb! You have a really long timer. Hmm. Let's see. Floating platform. Switches. Sing that goes boom. Well, considering it's using explosions to the right, it might be a sing I want to do. Hey, you. Um, I can't float one of those, can I? Alright, so if I can... That works. Well, this is kind of blow up funky. Alright, so I think we are ready to head on further. It's just, just a Siri. Only a Siri. We got the last screw, got the last key, heck with you level, we're out of here. 